Today we're going to be off to Juventus versus Lazio, fourth versus fifth in the table. Being the last match at Allianz Stadium, it'll be the final game for both Giorgio Chiellini and Paolo Dybala. Emotions will be flying, and to make this even more of a treat, we'll be sitting in a box worth 70,000 euros a year. Let's take a look around Turin and then head to the stadium. It's hot. Might be too hot. Heading into the depths of the stadium there. Juventus changing room. Soon. Final game for Chiellini. Big day. Huge day for him. Pretty disappointed today. Nothing to take zero points. The way was really disappointed with the way it went, but I have nothing to say. If I speak, if I speak, I am in big trouble. Walking out, Ali and Stadium, here we go. What a flight. I was up in the skybox, but now that things have cleared out a little bit, it's even better to be here. Pitch side. What a flight. What a stadium. Thank you, BitGet, for inviting me again, but I must admit, it's uh, to be back in Turin. It's about a little touch of rain. Oh, Juventus ending for a big day, some iconic players leaving the club, so it's a pleasure to be here. Great stadium. Ronaldo was just here two years ago as well, but Messi can go anyway. So. The wristband is on. Let's check out the seat. Let's go. Enjoying it, mate. Oh, yeah, it's, it's decent, yeah. Good tour. Um, no, the tour was right. Uh, we're going to go down for the warm up, but. I'm waiting for the the main course. I'm waiting for the I'm waiting for the food. Yeah. I'll, I'll let you know after the food, but um, and drink. So yeah. I'll let you know. The Sandra review. Wow. Four hundred million. What a number. I've never had pesto lasagna. It's absolutely brilliant. I'm gonna enjoy this. I want to say a big thank you to Juventus and BitGet for sorting it out. We're back here with my mates. We're gonna have another experience. A little less lockdown going on. It's the last game of the season at home for Juventus. Last match for Chiellini, I'm buzzing. The meals were top class. I'm excited to see the box with the boys. Inside the stadium here at Juventus. We've got about an hour to kick off. We've just had a, a lovely three course meal. Thank you very much for Juve for the sort of out. It was really good. I really enjoyed it. Now, apparently we're getting back onto the pitch for the players to warm up. Going to the pitch via the Tribune. Here we go. All these people with Dybala shirts, you can see all around. This is their final match. They get to enjoy with him actually being a Juve player. That is crazy. 45 minutes of kickoff. And a bit of a light show for the Juve players. English speaking. Here we go. Few players to mention there. Dusan Vlahovic, Quadrado, Marata. We're here pitch side. And the Juve players are out of We've got a United fan over here. You've got your eye on Delict. I'm scouting Delict and Milinkovic Savic. There we have it. Nice to see the players warm up. It's time to get back to our seats. We've got about 20 minutes till kick off, so yeah. We've been back to your last game of the season. Let's go back. We're out of our seat. Boys, enjoying the bit get. Skybox here at Juve. What a view. Wow. That's amazing. Jesus in our box. That is amazing. That's incredible. Jesus in our box. That is insane. Are out. Beautiful display here for Giorgio Chiellini. That's your way end. The pyro's out. 2-1 win to Juve. 2-1, yeah? Jen, predictions? 
three two Juve. Yeah, he's out. I want to ask him to score predictions. I feel like I'm gonna boss it. Trying to get Arsenal on the TV here. Yeah. It's not working, man. Kies is just chilling in our box. That's insane. I'm getting very giddy because we just went to Kies on the box. And I need Ronan to confirm this because the comments won't believe me, but he's boxed the videos. Especially from the Euros, I believe so. Can you confirm that? He did, no, he did. He knew the channel. No, he knew the channel. He said, you're the guy who does the YouTube videos. And I was like, I'm, you annoyed me, man. No, he never said that. He went, oh, I know you are. I watch all your videos. That's, that's even better. He still can't get the Arsenal game on the TV. Your score for the match. What are you going for? It'll be a close one. 2-1 Juventus. Two, one Juventus. Yeah, Dalvich, Dybala, yeah. Zaccani. Comfortable, comfortable. 2-1 from the big man. I'm going to go 2-0 Juve. I'm going to go Morata. He's going to be on the song here. A brace from Morata. Morata? Yeah. <laughs> you laugh. You laugh. You laugh. When I watch him live, he scores. You got it. Chiesa, you killed that. You killed that. You killed that. Federico called that one. 1-0 to you, mate. Boys. 1-0. Do something out there to the back post. Fiesa called it. I was wrong. Great atmosphere here at you, mate. Final home game of the season. And everyone's really enjoying it. I still can't believe I'm chilling in a box with an absolute bubbling leg. Look who's coming off in the 17th minute. Italian football, Italian football, Italy as well, everything. I love you. He's seen me lose the most important game I've ever been to in my life, the Euros final. And it was because of him and Benucci who ran that defence that made them win the game, simple as. So I, I can admit that guy's one of the best centre backs I've ever watched on the football pitch. Doesn't matter what age, his football brain was incredible. And his time's up at Juventus, so congratulations on a, an amazing football career here in Syria and for Italy. Chiellini is literally going the whole stadium and literally paying respects to everybody in the front here. Like, as a, that's, just, that's just such a nice touch. I don't know many footballers that would really want to do that. What a guy, man. Oh, lovely skill from Paolo Dybala. This would be such a good goal. Quadrado played over to Morata. I told you, he always scores when I watch him. Brilliant. Go on, lad. Go on, lad. Oh! What did I say? Morata always scores when I watch him. And he's done it. Hey, I told you, Morata. You laughed at me. I said Morata always scores. Juve 2-0, cruise control, let's get Federico's thoughts. Too easy, too easy. For now, for now. 3-0, 4-0? Nah, I say... I hope for another goal, but from Dybala. Yeah, yeah Dybala's, Dybala's yeah. come, Dybala's come. Got it from Chiesa. I can't believe he's here. <laughs> I'm claiming it, I'm sorry, Barry, I'm claiming it. Yes. <laughs> I'm claiming it. Thank you guys, thank you guys. Definitely for me, definitely for me. <laughs> Thoughts on Dusan Vlavic so good far? Player, very good player, he's holding up the ball, he's winning fouls, I yeah. like it. Still nil nil. You've got to win. It's, yeah, he's a confirmed <laughs> <laughs> No, he didn't, mate. You did ask him, though. Half time. 2 0. The guys have worked away to get the game on. Hey, you're at Juve, boys, go enjoy it. You're watching Arsenal. Do you have the, do you follow the Old Spy Bowl? Yeah, Old Spy Bowl. Yeah. Mate, we're just watching the Arsenal game. Who's getting top four in the Prem, do you reckon? We gotta go with Tottenham. Oh. <laughs> if he's got a goal back. I didn't even see that. Lazio scored. Start the second half. 51st minute. Juve 2, Lazio 1. Three goals. It's been a goal crazy match, to be fair. Predictions correct. Federico said 2 Lampard, Gerard scores. Who would, you, who would I rather have? Yeah. Lampard, I start because he scored the most goals. He created the most. He was always like from midfield. He got the best stats of anyone ever. Gerard's better than Lampard. Out of anyone ever. 
Who's the best player ever? For England? No, anyone ever. Maradona. Maradona. That's fair enough. I would say Maradona because he grew up uh, watching Maradona. Yeah. For me, it's Neo Messi. Yeah. Neo Messi. But I, I've, I've always you, said you Messi. You saw him scoring at the Wembley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did. He's a legend, man. Always the goal. You know when you see that live, you can't no, change no, no. it. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone yeah. is down yeah. live. Yeah, he's there. Well, you played with him. You played with him. Yeah. 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 That's pretty Cristiano special. Lazio fans, limited number there, but they're still trying to make noise in the away end. Europa League, it's okay, Europa League, man. It's still good, man. Europa League is good, bro. It's good, bro. <laughs> Tottenham will stay in that fourth position. Arsenal will be in... Shut up, man. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> As you can tell, we're, we're at a Serie A match, but things happen all around the world at the moment. Dybala coming off for you, though. Maybe the last time in a Juventus shirt. Look, he's coming around the ground. That confirms it, Dybala. Pretty much confirms that he will be leaving Juventus off this match. Two iconic players who played for the old lady off for a new challenge. And now a brilliant chance for Lazio to sneak a 2-2 draw and ruin Chiesa's prediction. It's a bullet. And it's a finish at the back post. Limbs. Limbs. Limbs in the away end. It's 2-2. In the final seconds of the game. What's just happened? Crazy, crazy. 2-2. Two, two. <laughs> <laughs> Newcastle have lost 2-0. Well, they've beaten Arsenal 2-0, should I say. What was meant to be a story and a party for Juventus, ending Chiellini's time at Juve, Dybala the same. A bit of a salty taste left in the mouth. Juve 2, Lazio 2. We've got the final strikes of the match. The away end is going absolutely rocking. It means a lot for Lazio, even though it doesn't make a massive difference to the table. They took their chance. You, they took their chance. And look at this. The players in the away end. That confirms the Europa League spot. One extra point in the tally for them. Means they're going to Europe next season. Massive for a club like Lazio. Limbs in the away end, and uh, well done. We had no idea a professional footballer would be in our box. Never mind someone who's one of the best up and coming talents in the world. And just to talk to him about football and playing with the stuff on camera, you would have seen like him speaking to him about the top five players in the world. His take on football, like I can have a podcast with that guy. He speaks great English. If I ever have a podcast, he's my first guest. One of the nicest guys I've met in football, Federico Chiesa, proper down to earth. Lovely display for Giorgio Chiellini there. Spectacular footballer. I have nothing else to say. One of the greats. We will always be a football legend. Beautiful moment there, showing with the kids. Don't worry, your open league is good. Your open league is good, bro. Benucci, a true leader, leading Kabbalah over to the fans. Very emotional. Tears in his eyes. Kabbalah has a lot of potential, and I feel like sometimes he's not always been able to maximise that. That is an emotional thing. Wherever he goes next, I wish him the best for his career. 
I think it didn't always work out with Juve, but wherever he goes next, I'm sure he can maximise his career, winning trophies, and moving on as a footballer. Dybala, Paolo, come to Bolton Wanderers. Bolton Wanderers, my team. Yeah! <laughs> no, 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 ignore him, ignore him. A little bit of banter with Paolo at the end there. Can't believe he responded to me, but what a day. I'm going to just wrap it up once and for all to spend time with Federico Chiesa. What a guy as well. Amazing English. So if he ends up in the Premier League for whatever reason, he, he can speak brilliant and what a sound guy to just have a chat with me and my mates who've just come from England. He made our day, he made our week. Uh, this is the best game I've ever been to in terms of experience and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's smash 20,000 likes and subscribe if you want Chiesa back on for a podcast sometime in the future. I hope he sees this video. I hope he reaches out again because we need to make it happen. Absolute legend. Juve was incredible. The match was great, 2-2. It didn't really matter to both, but there was loads of action and I really enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. It's time to get back to England. See you in a bit. Bye-bye.